Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, I'm going to show you how to enable the clock with seconds on the main release of Windows 11. Well, the clock with seconds in Windows 11 is a thing in the beta, dev, and also the Canary channel, but Microsoft is also adding the clock with seconds in the system tray feature early in Windows 11 in the version 22H2. For this to be enabled, you don't need 5 tool or any other things, you just need to be on the latest build of Windows 11 22H2, preferably, of course, on the main release of Windows 11 because we're talking about the main release. In this case, I'm on the latest build, which is 22,621.1635. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to enable that. And of course, if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. This is one of the features that is expected to be available in the Moment 3 update. And of course, a big thank you to Phantom Motion 3 for discovering the method to enable the clock with seconds on the main release of Windows. Windows 11. You're going to have his Twitter link in the pinned comment below, so you can go ahead and follow him if you want to learn more about hidden features earlier than others. Now to enable this, we're going to have to open the registry editor, just open the search box, type in here regedit or registry editor, right click on it and then click on run as administrator and on user account control, of course, click on yes. Here you're going to have to expand H key current user, then expand software in Microsoft and then scroll down to Windows, expand Windows, current version, expand Explorer, then advanced and enter into the the advanced key. Inside the advanced key, make sure to create a new DWORD 32-bit value with the name show seconds in system clock and set the value data to 1, click on OK. And as you can see, we now have the clock with seconds in the system tray. We don't even need to restart, sign out or anything else. We just need to do this little registry addition to create this new DWORD 32-bit value that will add the clock with seconds in the system tray, which is a feature from the Moment 3 update that we can test out early on the main release as well and I think this is pretty useful. The downside to this is that we don't have the setting in the taskbar settings that allows us to quickly enable or disable that because on the beta, dev and canary channel builds you also have an additional option here that allows you to enable or disable the clock with seconds. If you don't use Vive tool to enable it you won't have that option of course until Microsoft officially enables it but I think everyone wants to have the clock with seconds in the system tray so I think this is pretty good but of course if you don't want it, go ahead and access that, that same location in this registry editor and delete that registry or change the value data to zero in order to be able to enable it back again in the future if you want it. So this is basically it. This is a very quick video and I'm hoping that you managed to enable the clock with seconds even on the Windows 11 main release without using any third party tool. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.